Are you curious about what is the difference between doctor and professor? Most of the students have no actual idea about who is a doctor and who is a professor. So, in this video, we are going to describe about who is a doctor, who is a professor, and what is the difference between doctor and a professor. Wait till until the last minute to know what is actually the best. The difference between doctor and professor is in the rank, they hold at a university setting. Doctor is an honorary title, that can be conferred on anyone having completed his PhD, or doctorate, as it is commonly known. However, there is a common perception, that only people having passed the MBBS course and then having done specialization in some fields of medicine are referred to as doctors. Many people think that the professional who writes prescriptions and whom they consult when they are ill is a doctor while it is wrong to call a professor of poetry a doctor. This video attempts to find out the differences between a doctor and a professor to make it clear for you. Anyone who has passed his doctorate exam in any field of study can be technically referred to as a doctor. A doctorate is the highest possible degree in a field of study and, if there is a doctor of economics, it means that he is the person who has done a doctorate in economics. Thus, there are not just medical doctors in the real world but doctors in all fields of studies. If you encounter a doctor of literature, it only means that the person has achieved the highest possible degree in the study of literature. Doctor in this sense is an honorary degree. It is a degree one gets to achieve through research work. Professor, on the other hand, is a job title that differentiates between seniors and juniors in the teaching profession. If someone is a professor, it means that he is a senior faculty member in a department, in a university or college. A person cannot become a professor until he has done PhD to be eligible to be a teacher, PhD is not necessary, and a simple B.Ed can start his career as a teacher in a college. To progress in this profession though, he has to become lecturer, assistant professor, associate professor, and finally a professor to be at the top of the teaching profession. The confusion people seem to have is that the professors being called doctors sometimes, and being referred to as professors at other times. Technically, the first requirement for a person to become a professor is having a PhD once the person completes the doctorate successfully, he is known as a doctor. However, in order to become a professor, this doctor has to dedicate his time to teaching at a university, and also he should be involved in research work. There is no test for a person to take to be declared as a professor. This is mainly given as an honorary title for doctors, who have worked for their field of interest in many ways. A doctor is mostly a person from the medical world, and we think of all healthcare providers as doctors. This is true, but doctor is also an honorary title that is awarded to people, who complete the highest degree in their chosen field of study which is known as the PhD. A professor is the highest ranking position in a university. People who complete PhD are called doctors. In this sense, professors are also doctors. Professor is a job title while doctor only signifies that the person has passed his PhD. There can be professors even in the fraternity of the medical world, as they are doctors who become eligible to teach to junior doctors. To be both a doctor and a professor, one has to first complete the doctorate or the PhD. A doctor has involved in research work to obtain his PhD, a professor's involvement in research work is more. Professor is a higher rank than a doctor. These are the differences between doctor and professor. As you can see, both doctor and professor are very valuable titles. However, to become a professor, a doctor has to work harder and dedicate more time and energy into the field of his or her expertise. The journey to both titles begins with the doctorate or the PhD degree. Academic salaries can vary widely depending on rank, country, and institution. Here's what professors make in Europe and North America. All salaries are reported in the local currency and are pre-tax. Academic salaries can vary widely depending on rank, 
country, and institution. Here's what professors make in Europe and North America. All salaries are reported in the local currency and are pre-tax. In the United Kingdom, the average salary for professors was £79,030, in 2019 to 2020 according to Times Higher Education. Other senior academic staff made £82,506 on average while other academics, lecturers, senior lecturers, and researchers, made an average of £43,607. German professors are civil servants so national legislation fixes their salaries according to state. Junior professors, junior doesn't, make €49,548 to €57,373. Associate professors, doesn't, make €60,154 to €72,246, and full professors, professor, make €68,972 to €82,013. SACO, the Swedish Academic Central Organization, List the median salary in 2020 for a lecturer as 36,900 Swedish kroner per month. Assistant professors make a median of 40,000 Swedish kroner per month. An associate professor, lector, earns a median of 44,500 Swedish kroner per month, while a professor makes a median of 60,800 Swedish kroner per month. Taxes in Sweden are approximately 45%. Swiss academics are the highest in Europe. They are by each canton, province, and by law. At the Université de Lausanne, associate professor salaries range from 125,250 to 158,783 Swiss francs per year. Full professors make 149,728 to 171,380 Swiss francs per year. Full professors with chair appointments make 163,564 to 210,793 Swiss francs annually. At ETH Zurich, the range for assistant professors is 148,682 to 214,767 Swiss francs per year and is 178,996 to 245,080 CFH per year for associate professors. Full professors make 209,247 to 275,359 Swiss francs annually. The American Association of University Professors tracks academic salaries in the United States. Based on their 2019-2020 report, the average salary for a full professor is 102,402 US dollars. Associate professors earn an average of $79,654 and assistant professors average $69,206. The Chronicle of Higher Education also has a database of individual faculty salaries for more than 4,700 institutions based on information collected by the U.S. Education Department. According to a recent survey by Statistics Canada, the median salary for full-time academic teaching staff in Canada is $98,400 for the 2019-2020 academic year. Full professors are the highest earners with median salaries of $124,325, while associate professors make a median of $97,423. The median salary for assistant professors is $77,269 and $71,060 for staff with a rank below assistant professor. These are the main differences between a professor and a doctor. If you got this video helpful to you, please give a thumbs up. Don't forget to share the video among your friends. Subscribe the channel to join with us. Thanks for watching.